Today we witnessed an historical moment as just behind me is X-Bank Aerot's prototype of modular flying car, whose deliveries will kick off already next year. The cutting edge van will fully accommodate the two passenger eVTOL in its rear. So when it's time to switch to flying mode, it will be at your disposal. You can travel over 1000 kilometers in the car and you'll get plenty of time in the modular flying car. Aerot has just revealed a modular flying vehicle, providing a revolutionary solution not only in the field of 2D, but also 3D transportation. It consists of two components, the ground module and the air module, which can autonomously detach and reconnect. The air module sits in the rear of the vehicle, so when there's a need, it can show off in suitable environments, for example, to fly over congestion, obstacles, rivers and more. The air module can be guided either manually or autonomously. In manual mode, the drone will be controlled using a gear lever like on the eVTOL flying car. XPeng ensures owners will master the lever in less than a day, so there's no need to learn to fly before enjoying the flying experience on your own. The ground module is equipped with a range-extended electric propulsion system, which generates electricity from fuel, so there's no need to worry about the flying range of the air module as it can be followed by the vehicle and continuously receive a charge. The vehicle, dubbed a land aircraft carrier, is a six-wheeled all-wheel drive off-roader that seats four passengers. Considering its large dimensions, the vehicle has been given rear-wheel steering capability for a simpler driving experience like an SUV. The air module features a distributed electric propulsion system to ensure safety in case of a single motor failure. Previously, multiple single motor failure tests have been conducted on one of the other models, which passed successfully. The company also introduces a new safety approach to ultra-low altitude flying by offering a multi-parachute rescue system, which supports parachute deployment below 50 meters. The company says this system for flying cars is similar to the safety airbags in automobiles, which enables the aircraft to land at a relatively slow speed during an emergency, ensuring the safety of occupants. The deliveries of the next-gen modular flying car are scheduled to begin in the fourth quarter of 2025. First, we're going to sell it in China, uh, mainland. And, uh, but you know, Huitian is a global uh, intelligent uh, company, so the global market is our target. Maybe after two or three years, we're going to think about uh, sell abroad.